Hello everyone, I'm Toby from AbleDrummer.com. I developed a new technique which you can use for triggering chord information or note information from a MIDI source and trigger this live via MIDI notes, MIDI controllers, could be an e-drum pad, could be a push, any um, MIDI hardware which is sending MIDI notes could do this. So let me quickly show you how this works. So I have one device here which is on the track where I got my chords sitting. And those chords from this MIDI clip are being sent over to two instruments here. So for example, if we have a listen on the first one, we got a piano sound, which is playing the chords or the notes from bottom up. And I have a second pad here, which is playing the full chords on the same time. The next track would be a uh, bass soundtrack where I have, um, there we go. Bass notes, a bit quiet to be honest. Okay, so let's turn them up a little. So now um, the clip is playing and I can play Now I can just change the chords. I can play my second clip here when I'm ready. There we go. And let's we'll play the chords or the note information accordingly. So if you're interested in this technique, it's called synced trigger synced pitch from ableton.com max for life device max for life is included in ableton live sweet or can be bought as an add-on towards ableton live standard you will find links for this technique and for the max for life devices you will need to apply this technique in the video description below take care